gotta develop wind and soul. And I also want us to think about energy efficiency. Two things you gotta have to conduct your combat operations to close with and destroy the enemy, and that's ammunition and fuel. If you don't got those two, you know, you ain't gonna make it. Energy is critically important than ever for the war fighter. The better we use energy, the less risk it is to our troops. The reality is that when you look at uh, a war fighter, wherever they are in the world, they're dependent on technology and they're dependent on energy. We have deployed troops that are not fighting the war, they're fighting to protect fuel. We're seeing one in every 46 convoys suffer a casualty, whether it's wounded in action or killed in action. If you can improve the energy efficiency of whatever, it improves dramatically the ability of the warfighter to do what warfighters do. This lab is a, not only a collaboration of people, but it's bringing together technologies of various sorts into one place. This lab gives the Army the unique ability to streamline the development process. So we're able to get technology out into deployed vehicles, an eight-in-one facility giving us the ability to demonstrate thermal performance, fuel cells, even hybrid. The better we use energy, the less risk it is to our troops, the more effective we can be in the fight, and that soldiers performing their primary mission.